Hey, what's up guys, welcome back again to another Clash Royale video and today, as you can see over here if you go to your inbox, New Balance Live, 21st of June um, there are some card changes and the most important is that the Hog Rider got a damage decrease by 6% which is quite big um, we're, not gonna, we're not gonna see that many Hog Riders um, now because everybody was freaking using the Hog Rider so far and also the Prince, uh, the damage was increased by 9% and also P.E.K.K.A. damage increased by 8% so this brings up an old strategy the P.E.K.K.A. with the double Prince, let's go and upgrade this before we get started so I'm gonna waste 2000 uh, gold on that but um, also there were another, uh, more changes, more balance changes uh, not that important though the expo and the mortar got a uh, deploy time decrease we may see more expos and mortars now and the other, the other ones are not that important something really big as well is that the witch uh, got a 17% damage increase quite a uh, big increase so yeah mostly prince and double prince and that's why today we're gonna use this deck uh, arrows, freeze, minion horde, I love the minion horde elixir collector because this deck is a pretty expensive one 4.6 uh, average elixir skeleton army to counter the royal giants um, maybe a hog rider, I don't know if people are still using the hog riders um, P.E.K.K.A of course Prince and the Dark Prince, the three main troops of this deck this deck uh, was um, like it was kind of trending let's say a few weeks ago, months, everybody was using it. I think the prince got a buff, that's why... A nerf, sorry, a nerf. Um, that's why, um, it. I don't know, it's been a long time since I saw this deck being used. And oh, oh prince in the shop, I'm not gonna buy it though. So, uh, I'll show you a replay first, and then we're gonna do two live attacks, alright? So, here is the attack I did a few minutes ago against IBNOE underscore 68. Why is such a weird name? Alright, from the clan Jalanticus Jaya. Alright! <laughs> Not my business. So, we both dropped that uh, Electric Collector down. Uh, he's a level 8, I'm a level 9. Small advantage on that. So, unfortunately, I didn't get the P.E.K.K.A. on my starting hand. So, I had to drop th this combo. Use this combo, right? So, um, minions, minion horde, and Prince, look at that tower, almost killed it, if you didn't have those damn fire spirits, I could have gotten that tower, so, um, yeah, try to, I'll tell you some of the combos of this deck, the double Prince uh, deck, this is how I played, so, first combo is the Prince with a minion horde, so overpowered, if he has a fireball, you're screwed, cause he's gonna kill your minions, and he's gonna get the Prince to half health, alright, so make sure, he doesn't have a fireball or force him to use it before by dropping barbarians or skeletons, whatever. So anyways, here we go. Um, Prince, uh, no, sorry. Pekka and Dark Prince. He dropped the fireball. I dropped that stupid freeze spell. Uh, I didn't freeze the minions. I arrowed them at least. So that hour is down to 800 health. I don't know why the hell he's dropping that many electric collectors. Like, what the fuck? Um, yeah, he has a, um, as I can see, Royal Giant, but... When I attacked him, I didn't know that. So, 25 more seconds till double elixir. That's when the fun starts. So, drop the P.E.K.K.A. I think I'm gonna do the combo now. The P.E.K.K.A. and double Prince combo. Um, so, yeah, Dark Prince down. I'm gonna drop... Uh, what am I gonna drop? The Minion Horde to take out that uh, stupid um, uh, bomb tower. At Unfortunately, he killed my minions with his fire spirits, the little fire shits. Double elixir is on. Um, he countered the uh, pretty well GG. Uh, now, double uh, Ice Wizard among with his Royal Giant. He did some solid damage to my tower. And you know what would... The, you, what, wait, blah. I'm confused. So, uh, it would be fun using a mirror with this deck. And mirror the prince and have three princes and um, a P.E.K.K.A. so yeah, that would be fun so, um, his tower has 400 health, mine has 600 dropping those mini that minion horde, I'm gonna arrow that of course and look at my tower, like look at it 40 damage left and 15 seconds left and he has a fireball he can of course fireball that so, uh, the combo right now 
look at this shit, like, um, double P.E.K.K.A, double P.E.K.K.A, Prince and Dark Prince, OP as shit, I don't think he's able to defend, why didn't he fireball uh, my tower though, because I got his tower, he could have fireballed it and tie the game, he wasted his fireball there, like, that's stupid, but it was unstoppable, like, double P.E.K.K.A and double Prince, so overpowered, so, Let's get to the live attacks and show you the combos I use. So, we're going against Eftan, good luck. Let's give him that thumbs up. So from Chaos Empire, all right. Um, he dropped the Elixir Collector. We're going to do the same. And uh, that's basically the waiting part because we both won double Elixir. Um, I want to see what he's going to do, guys. I don't have the pack. All right, so I'm gonna drop those uh, that skeleton army to counter that royal giant. Uh, he's gonna zap, I think. No, he's not. So that's good. Come on. All right, I'm not worried about that baby dragon. So um, we can do the double prince combo right now. He almost killed my tower. Shit. <laughs> anyway, so uh, prince. Uh, he has those minions that I'm scared of, so I'm not gonna do the combo. I d I'm gonna drop the minion horde. Uh, hopefully, the minions will distract that inferno tower, because that inferno tower is gonna kill my P.E.K.K.A. But, oh shit! He avoided the hit from the prince. Anyways, so, 1700 uh, hit points left. I'm gonna drop the elixir collector right away. So, he has an advantage. Um, I'm not that worried though. So, yeah, I'm gonna drop the Dark Prince. I have nothing else to drop, like shit in front of ours. So, you want the P.E.K.K.A to go in front of the two princes. Unfortunately, this time the Dark Prince, I don't know, did he just quit? No. So, um, yeah, stupid. The, the one thing that uh, can be bad about this deck is that if the opponent has like Barbarians or Inferno Tower, he can fuck you up, like, those are the two troops. Basically, they fuck up every single deck, but against the Double Prince deck, they are pretty good. So, he got the tower, I'm gonna counter that with my minions. It's not looking good so far. Um, I don't think that I'll be able to do a major push. I may be able to pull one major push, because there are only 45 seconds left. P uh, P.E.K.K.A, down. So, building up Elixir, Prince going in, now the combo, I'm gonna drop the, dra the Dark Prince, unfortunately, shit, the, um, they are distracted by that stupid um, Royal Giant, and he's wasting my time, I wanna get the tower, dude, come on, I'm gonna drop the free spell, I haven't used it yet, oh shit, he dropped the Barbarians, dude, come on, come on, I have time, if the P.E.K.K.A, it's one hit from the P.E.K.K.A., and the prince. Alright, get it, get it, get it, boom, there we go, come back. Um, so, over time, this is why I love this deck. So, uh, we're looking good. Um, I wish I had the prince right now, I don't unfortunately. Uh, I'm gonna drop the minion horde and then the prince, oh shit, why did I deploy him there? Anyway, so, this push looks good. We can get the tower, no problem, I think. Yeah, <laughs> look at this, boys. Like double prince, Pekka, minion horde. There we go. That's game. Whoa, he is impressed. Let's give him a laugh <laughs> and a golden chest. Yeah. So let's get straight into the second live attack. All right. So same deck against Arthur 007. Good luck. Good luck. Um. Yeah. So we don't have the elixir collector. Um, straight from the start, not a problem. Uh, so, I'm gonna drop the P.E.K.K.A, he dropped that Knight. Knight? Why would someone use... I'm gonna arrow all those little shits. Boom. <laughs> well played. I didn't do anything that well, so... Yeah. Um, I'm gonna drop the Prince. And I'm gonna freeze whatever he deploys. I'm, gonna, I'm not gonna freeze the cannon. Um, they avoided the cannon. Awesome, so both the P.E.K.K.A and the Prince are heading to the tower, come on, get one hit from the tower P.E.K.K.A. No, she didn't, 
shit. Alright, so... I'm gonna... What am I gonna do? I'm gonna wait. Basically, no, I'm gonna push. Because I think he's out of elixir. Alright, so... He's laughing. Why are you laughing? <laughs> so, come on, Dark Prince. No. He didn't get a hit from the tower. That's good. That is good. So, I have the elixir collector down. And I'm gonna push with the P.E.K.K.A. And... I wish I had a prince right now, but... We're good. Looking good so far. So, he... Is pushing our left tower with uh, minions, not minions, the goblins and a hog rider. I don't know, it just confused minions, skeletons, and goblins. I don't know, I just can't say the correct name. Double prince and pack our combo is right there. Um, you want the Pekka to go in front of them and tank, get all the damage. Um, our prince is hitting that tower, he's gonna get it, I think. Yep, he is. And. Let's get the three crown, can we? He zapped? What a little bitch. No, we're not gonna get the three crown now. Uh, King's Tower is down to 1200 damage. So, Pekka. Um, deployed. I'm gonna do the combo again. We haven't used the freeze pull yet. He zapped. I'm gonna let him get the tower. Right, get the tower. Right, he got the tower so that the battle is a bit interesting because I don't want to three crown him right away. So, uh, my P.E.K.K.A is almost killed, shit, shit, and my Dark Prince as well, so, yeah, GG, good, not good luck, <laughs> well played. Um, I'm gonna arrow all these, boom, looking good, full elixir. And now we're pushing. Overtime is on. Prince! No! Don't go there. <laughs> Alright, so double pack. I'm gonna drop him right there. And it's looking good. I'm gonna arrow. Come on, Prince. Come on, charge. Charge and hit the tower. Boom. Alright, there we go. Of course, the normal Prince is way better than the Dark Prince. He does way more damage. And all those fire spirits are so annoying to just stop. <laughs> stop. So, yeah, we have time only for another small push. Yeah, only 18 seconds left. I don't know if we will be able to clutch the raid and get the, the win. Get the W, you know what I'm saying. And I think it's looking good. Come on, get them. Three crowned by the minions. Yes, there we go. Six seconds left. Well played. Thanks. Um, well played, Arthur. So, that's it for this video. This deck with the... Boom, Royal Arena. With the balance update is so damn good. Not only in the arena I am, of course, in lower arenas like um, Builder's Workshop, Spell Valley. Yes, yeah, so, uh, I don't think that... Eh, it may uh, work up in Legendary Arena as well. Try it out and let me know down in the comments below. Hopefully, I help you out a bit with this deck on how to uh, play this deck. You want to counter uh, like Royal Giant, Giant, Hog Rider with your Skeleton Army, build up Elixir with Elixir Collector, um, kill minions and shit with the arrows, and mainly push with P.E.K.K.A, Prince, Dark Prince, and sometimes with the Minion Horde as well, like the combo Prince and Minion Horde or P.E.K.K.A, and Minion Horde is so good, trust me, try it out. And Freeze, uh, whatever knows you. <laughs> yeah, so that's it for this video, guys. Hope you enjoyed this video. Uh, make sure to give it a big thumbs up. Subscribe if you haven't subscribed yet. And see ya in the next one. Played the game and I'm still the same. And I never changed just to get a deal, but I'm ballin'. ballin'. I came from nothing to something like...